Hey, I'm Robert. And I'm Jyrki. And this is the first in our video series about buying a house in France. In January 2020, we finalized the process of buying our house. And now we would like to share our experiences with you. So why did we actually end up buying the house in France? Well, if we take you back a couple of years, we received the keys to our house in January 2020. But our search had started from our living room in Helsinki, Finland in March 2019. It was such a long winter and very long, miserable spring. We had snow until May, and it felt like there is no end to that. And one evening we're so tired, so we're just watching Netflix, and decided to start scrolling actually. Properties. Uh, properties for in, sale. <laughs> in France and Spain and Italy, yeah. just to try and raise our spirits from the melancholy of the, the long winter. So we thought, wouldn't it be fantastic to have somewhere a little more south, or, well, a lot more south. Um, and then we started looking um, quite seriously. And of course, the more serious we became, we then started to kind of limit the criteria. And alongside the weather, the other good reason why we chose finally our area was the access from Helsinki. Because we here in Finland, we are the northernmost and the most easternmost <laughs> country of Europe. So it really takes time to travel to Europe. And if we think the very south of Europe, we should have done quite many links to get there. But the Charente area where we ended up buying our house is very easy to access through Paris. Yeah, it's only two hours um, with the fast train from Paris to the city of Angoulême and with many of the flights even to, to Bordeaux, which is also very close, um, they would be more seasonal from, from Finland. So really our main connection point would be to get to Paris. And with that two hour um, fast train, down to the area of Charente, it was really the, the perfect location with it being the hottest place after the Mediterranean. Charente has the microclimate and that makes it very warm, like you said. Last summer was extremely hot and all the summer, like three months, was between 35 and 43 mostly. What we did know was what type of property we were looking for and that was an older property, a character property, something with beautiful features and with big potential for restoration and a, a house that we could um, make glorious again but still make our own. When we started the renovation, the house had been empty for almost 10 years. There was a lot of work ahead of us, which we will share with you in our upcoming videos. One of the main reasons we wanted to start this video series was to tell about the, the process we went through the experiences we've had and generally to say that it really is possible for for you to have this dream also if that is your dream and um, that with with hard work and good planning it, it really is possible mm. to achieve 
house buying process in France is quite long and there are many stages. We decided to make a special episode about that, which might be, which might be then helpful for you who probably are planning to buy a property in France. And also, of course, you can follow our renovation project. We too do not have any previous experience in renovating and therefore, like Robert said earlier, with this video project we want to show everyone that it is really possible for everyone to reach that. Absolutely. Really.